Hello everyone and welcome to Sharp Dress Gaming and today we are back with another team builder. This time instead of VGC we're going to be doing singles. Um, I'm going to be doing an OU team featuring Mega Gyarados but not just any Mega Gyarados. We're going to go with the shiny Mega Gyarados. This is to celebrate the uh, release of the shiny Gyarados collection uh, for the trading card game. I don't know why I just absolutely love it and I'm going to buy it. It's coming out in two days, or wait, one day from now, the 24th, it is uh, out in some stores already, and it's to go with the, uh, the Breakpoint uh, bo uh, booster set that features the shiny Mega Gyarados. So, we're going to be building a team around him today, and he's been bopping around a lot lately in between tiers. Currently, Mega Gyarados is BL, and Normal Gyarados is UU, so we're going to be playing in OU, so we can use that Mega Gyarados. Uh, this is the stats for Gyarados via the battle spot ladder, so it is going to be a little different than normal OU, but I figured we'd just look at it for reference. We can see that Ice Fang is actually the most popular move on Gyarados, followed by Waterfall, Earthquake, Dragon Dance, and then a few other moves as well. Uh, for ability, everybody's using Intimidate. There's one person running that Moxie Gyarados out there. We also have Impish Nature being the most popular, then Jolly, followed by Adamant. And held item is Gyaradosite, or Rocky Helmet, for the most part. Uh, and then, for teammates, of course, this is a battle spot, so it allows uber Pokemon. So we see Garchomp is number one, Ferrothorn, Gengar, Mawile, which is most likely the Mega, Blaziken, Sylveon, Aegislash, Mamoswine, Rotom, Heat, and Hydra Dragon. So my plan for this team is to use a Water, Fire, Grass core. Uh, for my my uh, main build around for this team with Mega Gyarados. So Mega Gyarados covers that water part of the core. We just need grass and fire. And then I want a ground type for sure to uh, help with Gyarados' weakness. But because Gyarados is... Uh, Gyarad <laughs> because Gyarados has Mold Breaker for its ability, this one has Intimidate before Mega Evolves, but becomes Mold Breaker. Uh, we're going to be carrying Earthquake to hit those Rotoms that have Levitate. We also have Dragon Dance, Waterfall, and Crunch. I decided to go Crunch instead of Ice Fang. Uh, I've never used Crunch Mega Gyarados, and so I want to try it out. And we're going 252 in Attack, 252 Speed, Jolly Nature, 4 in that Special Defense. Uh, we named it Skull Kraken. That's what I named all my Gyarados. I read, I think it was from uh, Did You Know Gaming, put out a post that said... Gyarados' original name was supposed to be Skullkraken, but because of the limitation in names, they had to change it, because as you can see, there's no C or E in there. Uh, I don't know if that's actually true, but I like the name Skullkraken, so that's what I always name my Gyarados. So that is going to be our first Pokemon. Now, I have an idea for my fire type, but I want to look at all the fire types just to be sure that that's what I want to go with. Of course we got Charizard, but we're already using a Mega, so I'd rather not. We have Nine Tails, Arcanine, Rapidash, Magmar, Flareon, Maltrace, uh, Typhlosion, Megcargo, Houndoom, Entei. Entei is, a, is an option. But I'm not going to go with Entei. Camerupt, Infernape, Magmortar, Rotom Heat, Victini. Ooh, Victini sounds cool, actually. But I think we'll forego it once again. Ambor, Darmanitan, Chandelure, Heatmore, Volcarona, Delphox, Talonflame, Pyroar. And all of them are banned. Now, I am going to go for Heatran. I don't know if I, sp if I said it or not. I was going to skip it. But I'm going to go Heatran. Because um, <clears throat> Heatran really covers Gyarados' fairy weakness as well. Which is really nice. I'm going to go Broiler the Heatran. I'm not sure what I want to do with this Heatran quite yet, so I'm going to leave him sit for right now. Um, just because I don't know what kind of set I want to go with for Heatran. We'll see what other Pokemon uh, are going to be on the team and see what rules they fill out, and then we'll choose Heatran. Because Heatran's kind of versatile with what it can do. Um, I kind of want to do Choice Scarf Heatran, but we'll see. So adding Heatran adds to our fighting weakness. It also gives us a ground weakness, and uh, it does not cover electricity, but it does get rid of fairy, gets rid of grass, um, and bug. 
So now we can look for a grass type. Hopefully that covers fighting, um, electric, and ground. Grass type will cover electric, except for if we do grass water or grass something weak to electric. Uh, flying. <clears throat> uh, depends on the ground. Depends on if we throw poison typing in. If we do throw poison typing in, it uh, help cover the fighting one. And it would just be neutral to the ground. So let's go back to Showdown. And let's look at our grass type Pokemon that we can choose from. Kyo Venusaur. Uh, Vile Plume. Parasect. Victory Bell. Executor. Tingla. <clears throat> Meganium, Jump Luff, <clears throat> Sceptile, Ludicolo, Shift Tree, Breloom, Cacturn, Tropius, Cradley, uh, Torterra, uh, Bomb of Snow, Tangrowth, Leafeon, Rotomo, Shaman, ooh, uh, Superior, another ooh, Semi Sage, Levani, Whimsicott, Lilligant, Sazbuck, Among Us, Ferrothorn. <clears throat> Could go Ferrothorn and get rid of Heatran, but. Chestnut, Go Goat, Trevenant, The Revenant. Trevenant, The Revenant, huh? Trevenant's on the RU now? That's, that's saddening. That makes me sad inside. Um, I don't know, Ming. I don't know, Ming. I think it's your superior or shaman. Superior or shaman. <coughs> hmm. I kind of like shaman, to be honest. I never used the shaman. Where would I get a shaman? I think we'll save shaman. I, I kind of want to do a mythical Pokemon of the month kind of thing. We're all we're pretty late on Mew, so I'm gonna have to do that pretty soon. But uh, I think we'll just go superior. So pretty fast, pretty. Uh, where am I trying to go? Oh, here, team builder. And links for all of these uh, websites will be in the description below if you guys want to check them out when you're building your teams. Uh, they consist of Showdown, which is a battle, battle simulator if you guys didn't know. I've got Team Magma's Team Builder, which just uh, lines up all your weaknesses and resistances uh, to see what you're either super resistant to or super weak to. I have Pokemon Global Link, which is just uh, stats from the battle spot ladders. I have a damage calculator. And I have Cerebi to look at stuff. I don't. I'm not going to really use Cerebi. I just like having it just in case. But we have our Superior. Do I have a nickname for Superior? I don't think I do. I don't think I do. It's going to be male. Contrary, of course. <coughs> Leaf Storm. <coughs> Excuse me. We're gonna go Leaf Storm, we're gonna go Dragon Pulse. We're gonna go Giga Drain. We're just gonna go Typical Superior. And Hidden. Actually, we could go Glare instead of Hidden Power. Let's go with Glare. We can go just Leftover Superior and then get rid of Giga Drain. I'd like to have Hidden Power Ground. On this thing, in case we go up against a uh, Heatran. Let's do that. And then for this, we'll just go like that. Timid, max special attack, max speed. That's cool. <coughs> now, Heatran. I think since we have two fast slammers, um, I'm going to go with a bulkier Heatran. So let's go, we can do choose gender, so I'm going to go male. So I go air balloon. I'm going to go lava plume though for sure for its 
fire type attack and flash cannon. Oops. For that. And then I'm going to have him be a stealth rock setter. And for his final move, I'm thinking earth power. Actually, sub wouldn't be bad. I'm going to go substitute Heatran. I haven't used substitute Heatran in quite a while. We'll just go with what they tell me, special defense. And I'm going to go leftover since we're substitute. And flash fire. I'm just going to name you Henry, like King Henry, because he's like royal and stuff. Stiff. So there is our grass fire water core. And currently we're weak to fighting and we are weak to ground. Now I wouldn't mind having a ground type. Well actually Superior kind of blocks that electrical weakness on, on uh, Gyarados. So I'm not super worried about it. But fighting and ground, that's flying type to me. That says flying type to me. So let's go and look at our flying types. Pidgeot, Firo, Golbat, Farfetch'd, Dodrio, Scyther, Gyarados, Aerodactyl, Articuno, Zapdos, Small Trace. We could go Zapdos. We could go Zapdos. Dragonite. Robat Zatu, Jump Bluff, Mantine, um, Salamence, could go Salamence, Staraptor, uh, Drift Blim, Honchkrow, Yanmega, Gliscor. Gliscor does cover both ground and flying. Gliscor. Let's go with Gliscor. It shouldn't give us a ice weakness because we have both Heatran and Gyarados. You know it is double up superior because Heatran double resists, Gyarados one times resist, superior one time weak, and Gliscor two times weak, so it all evens out. And uh, doesn't get rid of our fighting obviously because we had we had a uh, times two fighting weakness, or we had two Pokemon weak to it, so Gliscor only covers one of them. Gliscor. I haven't used Gliscor in a long time. So let's go Gliscor. I don't know what county. I don't know. I'm sure I have a Gliscor name. Um, Toxic Orb of course for Gliscor with the Poison Heal ability. And Earthquake. I might change Gliscor to my Stealth Rocker. I'm going to go Toxic. Sub, double subby, double subby, and protect. We're going to be that Gliscor set, I think. The one everybody hates. And then we'll just do that. Looks good to me. <clears throat> and there's that. So we just have our fighting weakness still. We can go with a fairy type, like Sylveon. Um, let's look at our poison. We do have a poison immunity and a resist in... Who? Who resists? Gliscor. Um, and steel. Or steel. Steel type. We have four times and a two time we don't have any weaknesses. So we could go with a fairy. Sylveon automatically pops in my head. For obvious reasons. But, we could also go Clefable, we could go Wigglytuff, we could go Igglybuff, <laughs> go Azumarill, Granbull, Gardevoir, Altaria, Togekiss, Adeno, the Mega, excuse me, Florges, Romatisse, Slurpith, Denene, um, Clefki, Carbink, Mega Dionce. No Omegas, obviously, because we have our Mega. We could go with Dionsi, though. That would bring back our ground weakness with Dionsi or Denene or Klefki. Wait, where was... There's Sylveon. I was going to say, where was Sylveon? <clears throat> 
We do have quite a few, I mean we have two physical, two special right now. We can go with another special with Sylvia on it. Um... Hum dum dum diddly um. I just don't know, I'm at a loss right now. I don't know who I want to choose. Mr. Mime. Um. I could pick Togekiss and that would like demolish our fighting weakness. I think I'm gonna go Sylveon. Where'd it go? Sylveon? There you are. So let's do Sylveon. Oh, good old fairy boy or Sylveon from uh, the um, what's it called? The um, the um, I can't remember. Do we have leftovers on three Pokemon? Okay, I'm gonna have to change something around here. I might change uh, Gliscor to our Silt Rocker and make Heatran and Troy Scarfed, just because that's what I wanted to do anyway. But uh, Pixelate with Calm Mind, Hyper Voice, I should finish my sentence from earlier. Fairy Boy of the Sylveon is from our Naturia Nuzlocke, Hyper Voice, Shadow Ball, Hidden Power, Ground. I could go ahead and power fire though. Though let's go fire. So our, our superior is made to take on Heatrans and our our Sylveon's made to take on Pharaohs. That's kinda strange. I'm gonna actually change this to fire. And Sylveon will be hidden power ground. There we go. I'm gonna make this life orb. Just so we only have two leftovers. And then actually well this wasn't gonna be leftovers, was it? Well, let's yeah, let's well wait. Earth power, and I don't know what his last move would be with Choice Scarf. Oh, it's usually overheat. I usually put overheat on there. Just so it's super powerful. Let's, let's, let's not, let's not. I would like to have a few walls here, so I'm not just super hyper, hyper offensive, you know. I use hyper offense, offensicery too much. So let's go like that. Modest, max HP, max special attack. Then we have one Pokemon left. I'll put Sylveon right here. And uh, we're actually good at that point. I'll just not put a last Pokemon. No. We'll find one more. We'll find one more. So let's go look in through the OU tier just to see what they got lying around. We could go Bisharp. We could go Steel or we could go Dragon. Those Salamence like I wanted to do before. B, I love Celebi. Why don't we use Celebi? It says Superior. I kind of want to change my Pokemon now to Celebi. Let's do it. When do you ever see Celebi? Except for my Delta Battle Leagues. Which, if you guys didn't know, we're in the playoffs for the Delta Battle League, so... Um, if you want to see some more Celebi action, be sure it should. Celebi's actually been doing really good for my team, so I'm gonna go Hourglass to Celebi. This has to be leftovers. Natural Cure. We're gonna go with Giga Drain, Psychic, Leech Seed, and Thunder Wave. That's my favorite Celebi set. All time, we're just gonna go typical Celebi right there. Leftovers, natural cure, blah blah blah. Perfect. Now we can change this Heatran because Celebi is gonna be more of our. Actually, this is our special defensive mod. Celebi's kind of like there. 
Okay, let's leave that. Let's leave that. And then Gliscor can be Gliscor and Sylveon can be Sylveon. And we can change Superior to Celebi to see what weakness that gives us. It doesn't give us anything. Perfect. So it's a quick little change to Celebi. You know, you know. Now let's go look at again. Do the old U tier and hopefully we don't change again. Dragonite. I haven't used Dragonite forever. I wouldn't mind a I wouldn't mind a dragon, to be honest. Garchomp. Ugh, big stretch. Ippo is not a dragon. Hoopa. I haven't used Hoopa in an OE match. I know I built a team form at one point and then never used it. Jerichi. Oh wait, Celebi is getting its own mythical box. Never mind. We're going to be doing the mythical Pokemon of the month. So let's bring it back to Superior. What was that other grass type we wanted to use? Because now I don't want to use Superior for some reason. Um, it was right above Superior, I think. Methinks. Oh, it's Shaman. So again. So again. Same old story. Same old song and dance. So let's do that. Let's bring it back to how it was. It was Leftovers, right? No, it was Life Orb. What was it? Um, his name was Henry, and it was a male, and it was a leaf storming, dragon pulsing, hidden power firing, uh, glaring, superior. I mean, we don't te we technically need a dragon. Because of Superior, we could go Chunsei, but that's that's too much bulk. It's too much bulk for my liking. So actually, we could bring in Hoopa, but he's also a Dark type, and we have a Dark type already. Oh, and my Psychic type though. Oh wait, Sylveon. Sylveon instead of Shadow Ball. Let's carry Psy Shock. Yeah, that's just a it's just a little thing. Just a little thing. Just a little bit. Oh, uh, we could go Cure in Black. Oh, pop in my back. I do enjoy the idea of Cure in Black. Double Mole Breaker, double sub. You know, you know. Uh, but let's keep looking just to be sure. Uh, we have Latias and Latios. Magnazone. Manaphy. We've already done some Manaphy nonsense. We have Mew. Pinsir Raikou, Rotom Wash, Mega Sableye, Skizzy, Mega Skizzy, um, Superior, Skarmory, Slowbro, Sylveon, Starmie, Tornadus, Flareon, I mean Sylveon, I mean Talonflame, <laughs> jeez, three misses on that one, Thunders, Tornadus, Renatar and Venusaur and Levile. Um, we did talk about Zapdos earlier. We could go Zapdos. We could, in fact, go Zapdos. Or Kieran Black. I'm gonna go Kieran Black. So let's put Kirim right here, and that does give us a rock weakness, unfortunately, but I think we'll just, oh, up, oh, up. Oh. there we go, I think we'll just deal with it. So Sidious, the, uh, or Sidious, I don't know how I'm spelling it, we're gonna go with Kirim Black, I think Expert Belt Kirim Black. I kind of like that idea. With Earth Power, which ground type move, it's going to have Outrage to just destroy things. Ice Beam, unfortunately. And what's another good move for, for this guy here? We have options upon options. We could go Fusion Bolt. I'm going to go with Fusion Bolt. 100 base power. Um, gives it coverage. 
and we'll go bulky. Bulky. Alright, that's going to be our team. So we've got the Mega Gyarados, we've got the Heatran, we've got the Superior, the Gliscor, the Sylveon, and the Kyurem. So be looking forward to uh, seeing a, a, a battle with this team coming up. It is going to be on Wi-Fi, and I'm going to be asking for it. I'm hopefully already going to have it. But uh, thank you guys so much for stopping by. Let me know what you think of this team. I'm going to be probably trying to do some more singles battles because uh, it will just help in general with like draft leagues and that kind of stuff. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for joining me today, and we will see you uh, for the battle for this team. Stay sharp, everyone. Hello, everyone, and thanks for checking out the video. If you want to see more videos like this, be sure to click on the links on the screen. If you haven't yet, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe to see more videos as they come to your way. And if you want to go check out the GoFundMe, that'd be great, too. Bye!